Our final hunt for taste like chicken paradise wings us back out west to San Francisco, the golden gateway to some of the best Asian cuisine in the country. Here at Bodega Bistro, their specialty is squab. Pigeon to you and me. But what we consider a pesky urban bird has been a prized Vietnamese delicacy for centuries. And this little bird not only tastes like chicken, but looks like one too. Mm. <laughs> squab tastes a little bit like chicken, a little bit more moist. It's kind of like having the dark meat of the chicken, which is always the favorite part. <laughs> Bodega Bistro may sound like a Spanish restaurant, but in Vietnamese, Bo stands for beef, Day stands for lamb, and Ga stands for chicken. But none of those three meats are what make this authentic Hanoi restaurant stand out in a sea of Asian eateries. The squab is Bodega's defining dish, frequently landing on local food critics' top 10 lists. And unlike chicken, with this bird, every edible portion is served from the head to its feet. But after one bite, even the most doubtful diner will become a convert. It was a little intimidating on the plate, but actually it was really delicious. It was amazing. Chicken and squab, there's a, there's a little bit different taste. I mean, the squab actually is more juicier. It, the texture is pretty similar, but just taste-wise, it's a little bit sweeter. Mm. So juicy. At Bodega Bistro, they dish up Chim Kwai, which features a one pound squab hand picked for their restaurant from a specialty farm in Sacramento. I present you the squab here. That's such your favorite. It all starts with their secret spice blend that brings out the subtle berry flavor in the meat. And it's just a little bit. We can marinate inside. After the spices soak in for 45 minutes, the bird is bathed in soy and honey to give the skin color and crispness and hung to dry for an hour. Once the flavors have set, the squab is seared for five minutes in the oven and then quickly flash fried to seal in the juices and give it a satisfying crunch. The squab is then plated with caramelized onions and sauteed raisins, garnished and served with a lime sauce. Customers get to taste a blend of savory, sweet, and tangy in each bite. It's very tender and the seasoning is great. The caramelized onions are very good. It's delicious. The skin is really nice and crispy. It's really nicely sauced and um, crunchy, which is really fun. This is good? Very good, very good. Okay. Finger licking good. It may be finger licking good like fried chicken, but does squab taste like our tried and true poultry? It's very delicate and maybe more flavorful than chicken. I've never had squab before. Much more tender than duck that I've had. Sort of a more interesting, unique flavor than chicken. Can I have two squab for table one? Although everyone flocks here for the squab, Bodega offers up a plethora of other plates inspired by simple Hanoi street food including a stuffed shrimp and pork pancake and their baked Dungeness crab. Serving up unique flavors from home has been the dream of brothers Billy and Thomas Ho since the pair opened the Bodega Bistro in 2004. And although it may sound bird brain to the first time eater, daring diners dive into the squab head first. And some swear it's the best part. It's actually quite meaty. It's very tender meat. If you like the liver in a lot of game meats, it's perfect combination. And it's crispy. Who doesn't like crispy food? Whether it tastes like chicken or not, the squab's flavor will make any foodie spread their wings and fly. You have to try it at least one time in your life, and you'll be fine. You'll be set. Trust me. It tastes better than chicken. I couldn't ask for anything more right about now. Thank you. Rabbit ragu, turtle chowder, crocodile bratwurst, and green curry python mousse. It turns out that tastes like chicken isn't just a cliche. 